Welcome to Dairy Farm Pest Control number 52 with the FX Maverick in 22. So again, it, one of my many favorite dairies. Uh, spot that guy right off the bat, so I'm able to take him out. And this uh, starling sitting there looking so pretty. Uh, these guys are probably a good 40, 50 yards away. And another one flies up. I'm like, okay, I'll get you too. And then again, I got another one that's basically on that same spot. And I go ahead and take him out as well. And I go into the barn, peek around, and there's one, there's two. Number three, I couldn't see from there because he was in with the cows, so in with the uh, silage. So, <clears throat> so again, I'm using the FX Maverick in 22. Uh, shooting at around 880 feet per second and I'm using the uh, Hunter uh, Barracudas and again it's a nice hollow point so it doesn't go through the siding of the, the barn after I go through a bird so that's good so these guys are all in the corner and go ahead and take that guy out I hadn't been to this barn, uh, this particular farm for probably, I want to say almost, uh, well, basically since the when I cleared out the starlings, or when I was shooting starlings. So that's almost nine months ago, you know, six months, seven months ago. So they had lots of time to, lots of time to reproduce and they have been doing that. So these are about 30 yard shots. Bad. This guy's sitting there ever so just looking kind of what's happening. Maybe we'll go ahead and get him. These guys are all hiding. I think they're hiding at least. See on the one on the left, still sitting in that angle iron. He hasn't moved. Once they're caught, they're caught the special way, they're not moving. This guy comes down and then, ooh, he's like a drunk. It's like something's not right. This is not good. All systems are not go. wandering around he's looking down he's going Barney Barney where are you at Barney are you okay no and neither are you buddy look at that part picks up the blood even coming down the side it's amazing nice clarity on this thing nice shot from behind into the lungs and heart so drop him this guy's kind of close did I miss this guy I couldn't have missed him. You see his landing gear is down? He's not doing well. So now he's gonna limp over to that corner. And I'm like, no, I might as well just finish this guy off. So I go ahead and finish him off. There goes a little Tweety Bird. Came to investigate. That was it for that. Let this guy take him out. There, see that nice little guy. I'm not quite sure when he got caught or when, how long he's been up there. But I'll come back to him. That was a good shot. Just dropped him right where he was at. by the fans. Okay. See if we can't take care of you too, buddy. In with the ladies he goes. My favorite starling. No more. I couldn't resist. I'm going to take a shot, get him swinging, and finally. Whee! 
Down he goes. He landed a little bit too close. And I was fine with that. And he went down as well. Of these uh, pigeons this time around so I was really happy I had a lot of targets and this of course is a continuation from number 51 so this is all over one trip uh, when I was there on, in July so that guy was playing hide and go seek Where'd he go? Waiting for the cats to show up, but they, they didn't show up until later. That was a nice 60 yard shot. He's happy about that. Another Tweety bird. Here, birdie, birdie, birdie. Just through that netting, that was a nice shot. Sometimes that netting can really screw up with the, pest, the pellets when you shoot it, so it's usually luck of the draw if it goes through. I just got lucky. Is this guy gonna fly? Yes, he is! Straight down. I always think of that song, Gonna Fly Now. He has wings all ready to go, take off, and he ended up going nowhere. Starling. Nope. Ugh. Hate when that happens. Made sure that that was not a water line before I took the shot. Last thing I need is another water line break. That door is just littered with dead bodies. Just littered with them. Another one looking for his buddy. And he walks over to the right. And basically dies there. I love these pellets. They're really they're really devastating when they hit, which is always a good thing. Sometimes they still fly away, but that guy's He's going to make his last dive. Now, waited for him to move out of that cable and let him have it. And his friend comes to see him. He's like, Max, are you okay? Max! What are you doing down there? It's time for me to go see. <laughs> Gone. This guy's coming around. And he's gone. I love those pellets. This is a nice uh, 50, 55 yard shot. I got a lone uh, starling out there. And take him out. This is a great shot. I'm like, can I can I get this guy? I mean, I got like nothing to shoot at except for that head. And down he falls. That was a great shot. Focus. And there he is. And then he comes down onto that thing. I'm so happy right on top of the... Oh, that was perfect out now even though he got hit it's like mm. I'm like are you gonna die or not and you see the cow's heads in the way so it's not like I can take a shot but eventually the cow moves uh, and it basically succumbs to its injuries there so that was good 
These are nice long 60 yard shots on, on uh, Starlings. Missed that one. I'm like, okay, you gonna stay there? Okay. I'm okay with that. This guy's thinking he's okay. Is he okay? Is he okay? No, he's not. Down he comes. Now watch, ready? Get set, go! It's the 25 yard swimming meet. Here we go, one side, no. Oh, am I gonna do 50 yards? I'm going for 50, here I go, here I go. Oh no, I don't know exactly where I'm at. I don't know what I should do. I'm gonna go back here. No, I'm gonna go over there. Where am I gonna go? Shit, this is hard. I cannot go, where am I gonna go? Dude, this is not good for you. I don't care how fast you think you are. You're not a swimmer and you're not gonna make it. Man, am I tired. I am so freaking tired. I can't breathe. Yep. This is an amazing shot. Through the steel netting he had, I was able to get that one. And this is the last shot of the video. Nice 60 yard shot. And uh, landing gear is down. And then he just went over by the milk uh, truck. So thanks for watching and please leave any comments below.